And Yikes. then I told him, you think that's cold? You should see what I did to the Gamorrean. I never saw a Rodian run so fast in my... Oh, sorry, sweetie, didn't see you there. What can I do for you? We are here for the Great Hunt. We've been sponsored by Nemro the Hut. An all-girls hunt a team. Good for you. How long you two been partners? Is she playing something? Okay. I'm the hunter here. She just polishes my armor. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, thanks for that. Very nice. <laughs> you probably ain't gonna like what I'm about to tell you. But there's nothing I can do about it, understand? Okay. There's one spot left open in the Great Hunt, and over three dozen hunters who got sponsorships. What? Holy shit, 36 guys or girls? That's a lot of people to kill. Which I mean, that's the only way to get into this thing, isn't it? Those other hunters can go home. That spot is mine. It's yours if you can get it. Lots of folks will be thinking the same thing, though. The Huntmaster himself will explain how we're gonna sort things out. Head into the main room, and show some respect. When the Huntmaster's done talking, come on back in here. I'll be handling you from here on out. She's Southern, this is she. Yeah, she's Southern. Or at least the accent is Southern. Shine some respect. No, people, then my respect. I don't give it away, just like my car there and the money to beggars in the streets. No, I'm a fucking Wookiee. Are you kidding me? That's the hunt master. Well, Quiet. that makes sense. Quiet, you dogs. Huntmaster is about to speak. Pay attention and show some respect for once in your lives. The great good is a goddess. Many will hunt, many will die, and all will get the bacon. You heard the Huntmaster. You're competing for the last spot in the Great Hunt by taking down three bounties on Droman Kos. You expect us to hunt here with Imperials crawling all over us and Sith? Why not? That would be great exercise. If you're afraid to compete, the spaceport's that away. Yes, that's the spirit. <laughs> For all you overblown, useless, no talent cowards, we installed a handy exit door. Use it now. The rest of you, the real hunters, go see your handlers. They'll get you oriented to the planet and assign you three unique bounties. Everyone who takes down all three of their bounties wins a spot in the final melee. Anyone who doesn't get all three is out. Hunting on Drummond Koss? That's suicide. I'm grabbing the first shuttle out of here. I suggest you do the same, friend. You'll be one less body for me to step over. At least you got the attitude right. Don't expect this world to roll over for you, though. I'm done here. May your quarry fall before you, Hunter. I don't believe that guy. What are you standing guy? around for? Back to your handler. That's Krista for you, new blood. I don't. I don't believe that guy. Not one bit. He will try to steal my glory. I'm sure. How things work in the underworld. Alright. Krista, she has a southern name, doesn't she? <laughs> a dozen cowards just scurried out of here. Probably won't stop till Droman Kaos is light years behind him. You understand the basics, right? Three bounties, hardest targets on Droman Kaos. Gotta get all three to qualify for the final melee. For the final melee. I really like those accents. All right. Now what exactly is that shit? 
It sounds like a fight to the death. It's a marina or something. What exactly is this melee I keep hearing about? Ooh, it's a big old scrap. Everybody who gets all three of their bounties goes into the rage pit. One comes out. Now let's see who your first target is. Whoa, this can't be right. You've got enemies among the Mandalorians or something? Cyril? Just Taro Blood, the Mandalorian who killed Raiden. What'd he do? Okay. Calm down, Maker. No, there is no need for that right now. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> Should we be so... Yeah. Condescending. Yeah, why not? I realize... I saw, I saw how the mechanic works. You only go forward. It's not like in Dragon Age when there there is dislike and and uh, the opposite, which is love, I guess. Here you only build relationships. But I'm going to treat her like shit, so why not do it all the time? It'll be fine. What are we dealing with here? What? I wouldn't wish this bounty on anybody. <sighs> Gotta play the hand you're dealt, though. The target's a Republic noble named Baltaka. He got captured during an Imperial raid, brought back here, and sold into slavery by mistake. Okay. The Republic has nobles. Well, some of the worlds do. And you seen episode one? Tiamat. Go and watch it. Uh-huh. Well, I'm guessing they were going to interrogate him, uh, torture him, get some information, maybe, maybe some money. I love it when fat aristocrats get theirs. My thoughts exactly. Nobles can all go rot. I've seen how Imperials treat their slaves. It ain't pretty. Okay. Altaka's slave group was building a big old statue in the jungle. The slaves rebelled and took over the site. Nobody can get in there. We don't even know if he's still alive. If he is, the family will pay big. Ah, there you go. That's... How is that called? When you pay to get someone back. There is a name for that, I know it. For a... Ah, but I don't remember it right now. Okay, I'll think about it in a moment. Easy jobs bore me. You've got confidence. I give you that. The slaves got themselves a tent camp near that statue they never finished. If Altaka's still kicking, he's probably somewhere in there. Before you go, meet your new best friend. The S-86K full-gauge carbonite armor upgrade. You can't shoot a fella with this while he's springing around. It's too slow to charge up. But once that fella ain't resisting, say, after a good long beating, the S-86K will freeze him for transport. That's it, Ransom. I should know that I played a lot of Total War game games, yeah. When you capture enemies, you ransom them for money. Or you kill them all for fun. Aha! I have my own carbonite gun. <laughs> well, I guess dead doesn't pay as good as living. That's what she's going to say, but... I don't tend to take people alive. I hear you. But sometimes a payday is bigger when your catch is still flopping on the deck. You find that Republic noble fella and claim <laughs> that first bounty, then hurry it on back here as fast as you can. I feel like I'm in Mississippi or something instead of Drummond Cass. Talking about fishes in rivers, that doesn't make any sense. Alright, onwards! Yeah, sometimes I forget words. How sad is that? A ransom. Oh, 
Although in war it is not as... That's not a pejorative term, you could say. Not like when someone kidnaps a person to get money. Or, yeah, that it's similar but not the same. Ready for departure. Because usually when you kidnap someone in the present... Let's go... No, I don't need to go to a spaceport anymore. Enjoy your stay. Uh, you treat them like shit, usually. In the past, you did that with the lowborns or the people that could not pay their ransom. And the, the other guys got treated like, well, according to her station. So was not all bad in the, in the I think it was in the 100 years war I think that the British not the British the English were no British in that time the English captured the the king of the French or France really uh, and he was a very bad king I think it was one of the Charles all the Charles were pieces of shit. And this one in particular was very bad, and the French were very happy to let the, Br the British uh, go, not the British, well, whatever, uh, go around paying for all the expenses of the court of the king. And uh, they got uh, the, the son of the king, I think, was. The ruler in the meantime, where are the acolytes? This is one of them. Do I have to do something with a. And the British were so pissed off with the guy, eventually, that uh, they sent him back with an army. Taxas <laughs> uh, acolytes. Really, he didn't even do nothing. I would think a Sidaku like would say at least that what the fuck are you I really don't know what they expect of me. This is not a Sidaku like, well, he's an apprentice. It should be more or less the same. Yes! Are these Sith apprentices? Maybe one of these now they are soldiers? Let's go up. That's an acolyte for sure. So yeah, in the past, getting or ending up as a prisoner of war was not that bad. Nowadays it all matters on who captures you. If they believe in the conventions and the, the treatment, the human treatment of the enemy, which not many, at least not in the places where there is, there is war, not many people believe that their enemies deserve anything other than a bullet in the head. Most of them are poor anyway, so what could they gain? It's always the question. Where the fuck is another one of these assholes? Maybe you? They must have a... That guy? Yeah, a practice sword. All right, we'll return later to him. Uh, 
A musty trail. Ah, the heroic plus. Whatever. Maybe that now that I can heal myself, I should try to do that heroic thing. Should be able to pull it off. I only need to kill eight Mandalorians, that's not that much. On the face of it. Remove a spire or load the shield. Ah, yeah. If I don't do that, the whole city will go down. Ridiculous. I don't know why they tried to put... Are those enemies? No, that's the guy that gave me a quest. Urgency to your... Your quests. And they know perfectly well. It's just bullshit. I go up there. Good question. Is it this way? I didn't have to go up. There was there is something here nonetheless. A resource, what's that? Sizing electronic safe. Can I get that already? to kill him but that was a one-on-one -on -one. yeah I think on one-on-ones I can kill them problem is when there are more than one a small crate box more than one guy I don't think so and those Mandalorians are always in twos or threes. Fucking Mandalorians! They have no honor! Oh, I have to kill rails until I get what I need. Why not? Prepare the spire. That's a big thing. I think 
guy took the Anaratox way to get here. <laughs> Be more careful. Sure, we'll do. Okay, you have so many things on me. It's worse than DAO. That was a big thing. Statuses on one on top of the other. At the end there, you had so many pieces of shit on your bar. I played it on Xbox and I could manage. On an MMO, I don't know if it is even possible. Okay. Isn't this heroic plus two? Holy shit. My main quest is now Heroic Plus 2. Huh. Alright. That is not going to be fun. Let's try to do that. Most likely that will be the last thing I do today. Too much time setting up the stream. Much. I am not pleased with myself. But now I am one level above that. Or above them, but they are gold, uh, gold uh, enemies. Let's try to kill this guy only. Also, went here. I'm low health, holy shit. Uh. Ah, he's running after me. Holy fuck, I aggroed half the jungle. <laughs> Run! <laughs> ah, 
that was ridiculous. They were not even close, how did they kill me? Alright, I guess I need someone or... I can just finish the other quests and then up again. So I did fuck up badly. I have those things set up poorly, I think. My... I always click four. Four shouldn't be... This should be... Here. I think. Because four I don't use that much. Okay, let's try this once again. I know I can best them. But this one. Okay. There you go, he managed to kill one guy. But later on, he had to run. Three of them. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is impossible alone, I think. Need to find that someone? No, I don't have time for that. Let's go and finish some quests. The lap. This is something I don't like. I don't die. They were lying. Now I see that. Huh? Or can I heal myself so quickly? But I produce a lot of heat. No, but three guys is too much and they are always clustered. There is very little I can actually do. Destination? Enjoy your stay. Alright. I think that's it. Let's finish those two quests and... I'm done. I think my analysis of the beta is still is still valid. When I finished the beta, they asked me what was my opinion of the thing. And I said there was too much MMO on the RPG. And it appears things have not changed. There is still too much MMO on the RPG. Can relax. I've replaced the spire components. I was just about to call in evacuation orders for the city. Well done. The rebel slaves will think twice before tampering with imperial property again.
All right. That's simply too much. You should be able to do this solo, but no, they force you to team up. With a random stranger or your friends or allies or guildies or whatever. I'm not up for that really. I like to play solo because I play very distinct. I like to enjoy my games very differently than most people. Would I want to ruin my experience by sharing it with someone else? No. And this is a main fucking quest. The main quest is go uh, infiltrate the heroic area. Pfft. Are you kidding me? Destination? Enjoy your stay. That guy is an asshole! He's trying to hit me from behind. Okay. Look at him run. Uh. My clients already ambushed one of the acolytes you tagged. Wish I could have been there. Attacking Sith is a major crime, even for other Sith. I sent the authorities an anonymous tip to watch the acolytes closely. When my clients jumped the ones you tagged, they were arrested and executed. Best work I've done in a long time. I'm glad to see you're so happy. In this job, I don't get much chance to feel like I did the right thing. My loudmouth friend ought to shut up, now that the killers have been caught. That should make life easier. Here, take these credits. Couldn't have pulled this off without you. See you around, friend. Okay. Right, and that's it, I guess. Mm. Yeah, that's a, a big, big, big th fuck up by the game, I think. Heroic plus two personal challenge. Draw out and defeat Craig. That's not good. Not good. We shall see how we do in the future. Maybe tomorrow I'll be able to pull it off, but I doubt it very much. Until then! Thank you very much for watching, and long live the Empire. Fucking Bioware.